Peter, I'm not sure how I feel about this. I don't think that they're... Okay. I don't think that there are winners and losers when it comes to war. And I don't think there's winners and losers when it comes to an argument. I think that arguments happen because people get angry. And people get angry because they're addicted to it. Anger is not, na not natural. It's fear-based. I find that when we're in our most relaxed state, and when we're actually taking in everything that's going on, we don't get angry. Things don't make us... Th no, nothing makes us angry. We make ourselves angry. The fact that you're getting upset because of what's happening, you're letting yourself get upset. These people that, that say these nasty things, there's nothing we can do about it. And to say that YouTube needs to start policing people is a terrible idea. I believe it is awful. I believe it will be the downfall of YouTube. As soon as... That's what makes YouTube so great. They're not... It's not like YouTube is running the show. We're running the show. Us with our opinions and our thoughts. We're the ones that are doing it. And as soon as you start putting all this power into the website's hands, it's going to be bullshit. You're not going to be able to do or say anything you want. Or maybe you'll just, you know, maybe they'll be cool with you and they'll let you do what you want. And then all of a sudden you'll say one thing that bothers them and they'll take your video down. And that's like, it defeats the purpose of YouTube broadcast yourself, which is how they, how they sell their website. You know, they, they leave it to us. And the haters, that's cool too. You just gotta talk to them as real. I mean, talk to every them like real people. Talk to them like you would talk to everybody else. Don't get angry. It's not a war. There's, you know, the, the only conflict that exists is the conflict that we create within ourselves. That's what I think.